Hello everyone, this is Nick from Quality Business Machines and in this video we're going to show you guys how to do your initial settings in your GVI app for GeoVision. Now these are the settings you're going to want to do right at the beginning of installing the app before we even get into installing any cameras or our locations. This will just make uh, installing our cameras for our locations much easier down the road. So here's our basic home page. What we're going to want to do is go to the settings wheel in the top right and click on that. That brings up this list right here. I'll go over the things you need to worry about. Uh, demo mode, if you turn that on, it just gives you the option to look at GeoVision's demo cameras. So don't even worry about it. If we go to this auto add to live view tab, we do want to turn that on. What that does is uh, when you install the cameras initially, if you don't have auto add li to live view set up, you'll have to add the cameras one at a time, and we'll show you that later. But this way, it just adds them for you. It makes sense. So go ahead and turn that on. The disable screen off button right here, that's pretty cool. If you were to turn your app on and you just set your phone down or trying to watch it out of the corner of your eye, it keeps your phone from defaulting to like sleep mode or, or locking the screen. Show device name. Uh, it'll get, show you the camera number or whatever name you give your cameras on their screen. Show device time. It shows the time of the footage you're looking at. Uh, right here, the keep image ratio. That's cool. Uh, a lot of cameras will stretch if you don't tell it to keep the uh, image ratio on, so we always like to keep it on. We can ignore the arm and email, uh, the edge tool. Uh, m almost none of you guys have a PTZ, uh, so that's not a big deal. If we go down here, we'll see uh, default username and default password. Uh, that's just a place for you to put in your username and password for your VMS or multicam software now and that way when you if if some of you guys have multiple locations you're setting up multiple stores um, you don't have to enter the username and password every single time if we go down to the very bottom where it says upgrade and click on that it pulls this up this is how you get uh, the ability to de-warp your fisheye from the phone app. It is uh, an in-app purchase. It's the one thing GeoVision asks of you cost-wise inside the phone app, and this is where you would do it at. All right, guys, that's your basic initial settings for the GVI app for GeoVision. Thank you for watching, and we'll get into setting up cameras and locations on our next video.